Okay, so we are at the next question now. Let's read the question together. Jane conducted the experiment as shown below. Now she got water from three different sources, X, Y and Z, which was in beaker A, B and C respectively. So uh, she put, you know, uh, water from X here, water from Y here and water from Z here. And so sometimes what I'll do is I'll just put it here. Uh, so that I don't forget, right? So this is water from X, alright, and this is water from Y, and if it, and lastly this is water from Z. Okay. Uh, this is what we call um, students from my class would know. We call this MTV. What is MTV class? Yeah, right, right. Making thinking visible. Okay, so now uh, she placed two similar water plants and three similar guppies into each of the beaker. So what she's doing here is that she is making everything else the same, right? So uh, let's write that down. Let's make our thinking visible. She changed one thing, okay? She changed uh, only one thing, which is the sources. Uh, or the type of water, am I right? The type of water because different sources of water uh, could give you uh, different types of water, okay? So she changed the type of water but in the next paragraph we know that she kept everything else the same. Okay, so everything else is a constant, right? So what she changed was the type of water uh, the constants were everything else. Now we know that in a science experiment, everything else, everything else must be a constant. Uh, you can only change one thing. Now by changing only one thing, then you can be sure that it is that one thing you change that is affecting the results. Okay. Uh, one more time. Huh? Maybe I'll write that down so you you can remember. Okay, I'll write it down here. Okay, in an experiment, okay, we only change one thing and keep everything else the same, right? Why? Why do we do this? Okay, this is so that, right, we know, this is so that, this is so that, we can be sure that it is because of that one thing we changed, okay, that has affected the results, okay, or affected the results of the experiment, okay. So I repeat one more time in an experiment. We only change one thing and keep everything else the same. Okay, so we keep only, we change only one thing and everything else we keep the same. This is so that we can be sure that it is because of that one thing that you change. Okay, it is because of that one thing that you change that has affected the results of the experiment. Okay, so in this uh, example, in this question, we know that, uh, you know, the aim, uh, we are supposed to find the aim of Jane's experiment. Okay, so let's have a look. The aim of the experiment is to find out, okay, how that one thing we change affects the one thing we measure, or the, what we measure at the end, okay. Affects what we measure at the end. Alright, so what is the aim of the experiment here? The aim of the experiment is to find out how the one thing we change. What was the one thing we change? The type of water, right? The, the type of water and how it affects what we measure at the end. So if we look at the setup, what can we measure? We can measure several things, okay? We can measure the, the uh, growth of the guppies, we can measure the growth of the plants, uh, and so on. Okay, but in this particular question, okay, if you look at the option, we know that number one is not correct, okay, uh, because we didn't change the light. We know that number three is incorrect because 
uh, we put the guppies all together with the plants in all three setups we didn't change that uh, and number four is incorrect because uh, we didn't change uh, the feeding of the guppies okay uh, we didn't our setups didn't show anything about how the guppies are being fed so the answer is number two the aim of the experiment is to find out how the type of water affects the growth of guppies so the aim of the experiment is to find out how the type of water affects the growth of guppies the answer is number two okay so as usual if you disagree with my answer uh, type it in here uh, tinyurl.com slash askmrzaki okay or you can also um, uh, wait till you see me on monday and and we can discuss this question okay uh, if you have any other question that you are in urgent need to find out the answer for, uh, do type, go to this website again and type it in and I will explain that question first. Okay, if not, uh, keep visiting that Google site and I will upload more videos whenever I have explained it to you. Thank you.